It's a great day. I'm Andrea M. Stuckey. I'm the founder of Live Life Loved Coaching, Divorced Women Unite, and the Divorce to Destiny Academy, where we help women rebuild, redefine, and liberate their lives following separation and divorce. Today, I want to talk to you really quickly about rebuilding confidence like a champion. Rebuilding your confidence after divorce like a champion. Oftentimes, going through a separation and divorce, many men and women feel like their confidence within themselves has been stripped. Oftentimes, the tumultuous uh, seasons of a negative relationship can really wear you down over time. And so I find in my coaching practice that many women are struggling in this area to rebuild their confidence. So I want to share with you three tips on today on how to rebuild your confidence like a champion. I remember like yesterday what it's like to have gone through or going through that transitional season after divorce. You see, I've been divorced twice and in my mid 20s and early 40s. And so I definitely, definitely remember what it's like to kind of rebuild your life and redefine yourself. Point number one, the very first thing is that you have to learn to affirm yourself. You have to learn to affirm yourself and speak positive words about yourself. The Bible tells us life and death are in the power of the tongue. And I really, really, truly believe this is that we become the words that we speak. And so as you're developing and growing your confidence and there are things in your life that you want to create within yourself or create within your environment, you have to speak that to yourself. It's very important that you speak positive words, not negative words about yourself. Speak what you want, not what you see. Speak what you desire in your life. Point number two, pursue personal development. Now this is key. As a life coach, I'm all about personal development and I work with my clients in this area in my coaching practice. There is nothing more powerful than you being on a journey of developing yourself. We all have strengths, we all have weaknesses, and oftentimes when you've come out of a long-term relationship, you've come through a marriage, you end up in divorce, a lot of times you're not focusing on the right areas of your life and you're not developing the areas that you need to become stronger in. And this is a commitment that you really need to make uh, for yourself and to yourself in order to rebuild your confidence so that you can show up in the world as your best self each and every day, each and every day. You wanna to begin to educate yourself. This is an information age, right? Even as a life coach, I offer courses, I offer programs that specialize in areas that divorced and separated women need, like rebuilding confidence, uh, like rebuilding your self-esteem, creating boundaries. There are courses because what you, you don't know what you don't know. And if you don't know how to create boundaries, if you don't know what's required to build up your self-esteem, the way that you think and feel about yourself, then it's going to be very difficult for you to achieve that, right? And oftentimes you need support and you need guidance along that journey. And this is what I work with my uh, clients, my coaching practice, in my community. I offer a lot of these courses and free trainings as well to help you learn to uh, go along that path of path, excuse me, of personal development. And then thirdly, you have to believe in yourself. You have to believe that you can do whatever you set your mind to. Believe it or not, no matter what you've gone through in the past, if you've come out of an abusive relationship, I have been there. If you've come out of uh, infidelity or betrayal, I have been there. You can still do whatever you put your mind to. You have everything inside of you that you need for this next season of your life. You just don't know it. And you just don't know how to pull those strengths out and how to position yourself as you navigate this next space and next season of your life. And I'd love to help you with that. 
I'd love to help you with that. Uh, one of the resources that I use with my clients in my programs and in my one-on-one -on -one clients is my Liberation Journal for Divorcees. It's 90 Days to Renewing Your Personal Freedom. And in that journal, um, it has guided affirmations, guided reading, guided areas to help you commit to self-care and to commit to your growth in a place and position to put your thoughts down. And journaling is so powerful because it allows you to create um, a space where you can see your development. You can see what is making you grow and what is taking away from your personal growth and confidence, right? And so if you're interested in purchasing that, which you should, go to bit.ly forward slash liberation journal. It's an ebook, it's a download, and uh, you will absolutely love it. It is a game changer. Again, I use this in all of my group coaching programs and with all of my clients. And if you use that on a consistent basis, you will definitely begin to see some change in your life. But we're talking today about rebuilding your confidence. Listen, divorce is not the end all be all. And there are times when it feels like it. It feels like you're on an emotional roller coaster that you will never come off of. But I want to tell you today, you will get off that emo emotional roller coaster. You are an overcomer. There's so much more life for you to live. It doesn't matter what your age is. It doesn't matter what you've been through. You can live and love again if that is what you desire. I want you to stay encouraged today. Make sure you stay connected with me. If you're interested in a free consultation, I would love, love, love to talk to you. Go to bit.ly forward slash divorce liberator, all lowercase, all one word. It's just type that in your search bar and you'll get right on my calendar. Okay, it'll give you an option to pick a time and a date. If you're a separated and or divorced woman and you're looking for a supportive encouragement community, I suggest my community, Divorced Women Unite over on Facebook. And you can go directly to that, bit.ly forward slash Divorced Women Unite, and uh, we'll let you in that closed safe space. Make sure you're following me I'm on all social media platforms at Divorce underscore coach seven at divorce underscore coach seven at divorce underscore coach seven i'm on periscope.tv instagram and twitter and so i look forward to connecting with you soon remember you're able to rebuild your confidence after divorce there's so much more life for you to live i'll see you next time